What's up guys, welcome back to the channel. It is Wednesday, March 31st of 2021. And before I get into the content of today's video, I wanna talk about the issues that I've been having with my Garmin watch. Um, for those of you that don't know, I have a Garmin Forerunner 45S, um, which isn't technically on the high end of the Garmin watches, but it's a pretty decent watch. And I would say it's done pretty good up until about two weeks ago. Um, I think during week 11 of this marathon prep, it, the GPS um, stopped working correctly. Um, for whatever reason, I don't really know. Um, as far as wearing it, I didn't you know, drop it or do anything like that. Um, but about two weeks ago, um, I was running and I, you know, I started thinking, you know, these miles are taking longer than they usually do. And for any runner, you know, um, if you've ran at a certain pace for a while, you know what that pace feels like. You know how fast that pace feels. And you know if you've ran in a similar area, you know how far one mile is, how far two miles is. And you get that sort of intuition about, um, you know, how far each mile is without having to look at your watch. Um, and about two weeks ago, when I had the 20 mile run, I think my mile wasn't ending where it should have been. And that's, that was what was going through my head. And I thought, you know, maybe I am slowing down. Maybe, you know, it's me. Um, so I got curious. I went to the track on Saturday, a high school track, my old high school track. I went there. I ran a mile, started my watch. You know, I ran four laps around the track. And, you know, mile is 1,600 meters. Um, I ran the 1,600 meters, stopped my watch, and it read 0 0.84 miles. So that's telling me that I'm actually running farther than what I need to be. So let's just say, you know, I have a workout that is four miles for the day. I'm probably actually running um, closer to five, probably four four miles and three quarters um, because my watch is off 0 0.16 um, tenths of a mile or hundredths of a mile. So, so I don't really know what the issue is. I've tried, you know, looking up different things. I've tried um, adjusting a few things on my watch, um, but that hasn't seemed to help. So if you know of anything or know of anybody that can fix it, leave it down in the comments. So that way I can get this fixed before the marathon, which the marathon is probably um, 10 days to be exact. But if not, it's not that big of a deal. But I wanted to talk about that issue because it's is very relevant in the running community and it's very relevant um, for my marathon prep so yeah so enough said about the the Garmin issues um, today I have a four mile run just an easy pace um, close to a, my marathon pace um, maybe a little bit over my marathon pace so eight minutes to eight minute and ten second per pace per mile um, Something light, I definitely don't want to overdo it with only 10 days left. Um, yeah, so that's the workout today. Um, I hope you enjoy this video. Um, if you do, don't forget to leave a like, subscribe, comment down below. I would greatly appreciate that, guys. Um, and like I always say, sit back, relax, and enjoy the show. Hey, what's up, guys? I just finished the first two miles. A little bit cold out, but all I got is two miles left. I'll see you guys after. So I just finished the four mile run, guys. I ran these four miles in 32 minutes and 14 seconds at an eight minute and three second pace per mile. I was able to hold pace good today, finish the four miles, and yeah, that's a wrap for today, guys, but I'll see you guys again tomorrow. Stay tuned. What's up, guys? It is Thursday, April 1st of 2021, and we are officially nine days away from the marathon in Lexington. So, on the schedule today, I have a four mile run, just like yesterday, and yeah. Let's get right into this content. What's up guys, two miles down. 
two left to go. I'm running a little bit faster than what I want to. Right now I'm averaging a seven minute and 40 second pace. So I'm gonna slow it down a little bit. And I'll see you guys after the four miles. So I just finished the four mile run, guys. I ran the four miles in 31 minutes and 35 seconds at a seven minute and 54 second pace per mile. It was pretty chilly out today. I don't think it's been this cold since I ran in February or January, but it is 38 degrees outside, I think, today. So it's pretty chilly, and the wind um, was kind of harsh today, but still a good run. I don't know if I'll video Saturday, but Saturday I have an eight mile run. Um, but if not, that is a wrap for the second week of taper. And next week, guys, next week is the last week of preparation before the marathon. The marathon's actually next Saturday. Like I said before, nine days away, guys. So I'm really excited. And if I don't see you Saturday, it's a wrap for this week.